To get an accurate takeoff, use the mouse wheeler to zoom in as close as possible to the area. For rectangular area room, use this free draw rectangular tool to capture the area. Left clicking on one corner of the room, press on the cursor. Drag to the opposite corner. Release the cursor. It creates a rectangular shape. To get an accurate takeoff, use the mouse wheel to continue on to use to the next rectangle area or to exit the mode, right click or click on any other command under the takeoff tab. For any shaped area, use this free draw tool. Click on this free draw icon to enter free draw mode. Under this icon, left product panel is now hidden to make more space for the takeoff. There are two tab of commands. There are two tab of commands under this mode, mostly to facilitate the site measuring drawing process. For commercial takeoff, these drawing settings option icons are worth noting. 90 and 45 degree angle lock is by default toggled on. To lock drawing line by 90 or 45 degree angle so that it's easier to draw straight lines. Show crosshair is also by default toggled on to display cursor with crosshair lines, so it is easier to line and capture corner points. Auto scroll when toggled on will automatically scroll the plan image along the drawing line to expand to more area. It is useful when a takeoff area spans to a bigger region. To take off an area, start from the upper left corner point. Left click, then move to the next corner points clockwise. Left click and continue on tracing around the perimeter of the area. By default, drawing lines are locked 90 or 45 degree angles to facilitate the drawing the majority of this cases. During the tracing, for walls that are not 45 or 90 degree angles, simply press and hold shift key and swing mouse cursor to match the angle. Release shift key to resume to default drawing mode. For curved walls, simply connect two ends of For curved walls, simply connect two ends of the points of the curved with a straight line. Then come back to convert it to a curve after closing the shape. Optionally, to draw a curve segment directly in a free draw, from the starting point of the curve, move the cursor and left click to capture a point on the curve. Then holding down the R key, R stands for radius, now the last line turns into an arc. Now move cursor to the other end of the curve and left click to complete the curve. Release the R key or turn off arc icon to continue on with the drawing. For internal walls, one may trace For internal walls, one may trace around the corner points as if they are regular walls or skip them and they can be added with internal wall tool at the next step. To undo any steps while drawing, use Ctrl Z on the keyboard or click on undo icon to back up one step or multiple steps. To close the loop at the last corner point, click close shape icon or hit the space key. The program will automatically close the shape to its starting point. With the close shape icon, it closes the shape with straight angle when it is slightly off.
if you use the space key, it will close the, with the actual angle. One may close a, one may close a loop with right click as well, which also exists the free draw mode at the same time.